What is going on everybody in Mask Squad? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're going to be doing a gaming test for the Blue G90. Stay tuned. So, Maxwell, we are about to be doing a gaming test here for the Blue G90. And the game I'm going to be playing is Call of Duty Mobile, of course. And uh, just going to give you an example of what the graphics or what the CPU inside this device or GPU is capable of displaying here. Now, when I played it in the past, probably like, what, maybe a day or so ago, uh, the resolution was not the best, but the frame rate was still pretty high, which is uh, pretty interesting. All right, so I do apologize about that. Went ahead and changed what it was actually leaning up against. So uh, if you look at the graphics here, I'm going to get a little closer. Uh, you can see that the graphics quality is on uh, low here, and it says to reduce and uh, to reduce no reduce to improve performance, prevent overheating, and conserve power. And then uh, on the frame rate here, we got it on high, so you can keep it pretty high, but you just can't have too good of graphic quality here with the processor in this device. So that's one thing to keep in mind with the Blue G90 here. Gaming is going to be, you know, definitely passable, but it's not going to be on the same level as uh, other devices, of course. I'm here, so All right, let's see. All right, so I'm already in the game. Let's go. The heck? What happened? Did he, did he freeze on me? Alright, a little too into this game here, so hold on, let me see. Yeah, that was a little too easy here. So, uh, oh yeah, by the way, I'm playing with a controller here, as you can see. Got the Xbox controller. I think it's a better controller than PlayStation, but you know, we're not gonna have that debate. Okay. Well, I feel like I'm gonna need this one. There's a little bit more damage. All right, let's get it cracking. You have good mobility with this gun here. You run really fast. I feel like somebody's gonna be around this corner. Let me see. Gotcha. Ah, I should have got that one. Ah, uh, I should have got that one. All right, let me see. Trying 
trying to get me from behind, bro. You don't do that from behind, joint. You gonna try to get me from behind and you ain't even hit me? Come on, man. You trying to pull up? Got a gun down, brother. You better have a quick reaction time if you trying to pull up on me. Get out of here. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. It's not that much talking going on here. Get out of here. I should have. Mm. Let me see if I can change. Let me let me let me try a different uh a different loadout. Let's see what happens. So the mobility is definitely a little slower. about that lag just now, y'all. So we got that W there. So let's see what happens here.
So graphic quality literally set it in the bottom left corner. You could probably rewind this video back and see it. It's at low quality. That's hilarious. So I probably didn't get 20 kills, but you know, I'll take MVP. I'm not mad about that at all. It was actually a little harder than expected here. So yeah, I only got 15 kills there. So, I mean, that's pretty much going to be it here for the gaming test on the uh, the Blue G90 here. Uh, let me go into the loadout really quickly. Okay. And also, uh, I just recently took this device off the uh, the charger here, and I'm doing a battery test as well. And uh, we only used about 4% of the battery, which is pretty good. Oh, let me see. Yeah, 4% of the battery so far. So go ahead and quit the game. So with the Blue G90 here, as far as gaming, it's going to be pretty much average at best. Uh, you're not going to be able to put on a too high of settings as far as graphic quality here, but you do get a pretty high frame rate if that's something that matters to you. Then, you know, you might want to stay away from this device. But if you're just a person who wants to game casually and doesn't really care about the super high quality graphics on every single device or on budget devices, then you're going to be perfectly fine with this one here. It played Call of Duty with no issues. Um, the frame rate was pretty high. It's just uh, sometimes you get a little bit of lag in between, uh, like a couple of those kills that I had in the gameplay. If you uh, slow down and rewind, I probably showed it in B-roll here with me talking. Uh, it was a little bit of lag as far as going up the stairs and uh, a person coming at you, trying to shoot at you from the opposing team. So, you know, little things like that might actually give you some trouble here. But that's pretty much going to wrap up this gaming test video here. Uh, don't really find a need to actually play another game as far as uh testing the graphic quality here it's clear on call of duty mobile that that's pretty much as maxed out as it can get so uh, let me know in the comment section do you think the blue g90 will be a uh, good device as far as gaming here and uh if not as far as what other games that i can play here let me know in the comment section below to really test out the graphic quality of this device here and if you're new to the channel here consider subscribing so that you don't miss any coverage when it comes to budget devices like the blue g90 and Matt Squad, like this video here so that other people just like you can get a little bit more help when it comes to researching budget devices like the Blue G90 here. So you can see if it's pretty good at gaming. And last but not least, share this video with your friends and family and let them know that not all Android cameras suck. It is just not true. But until then, my name is Max Rock. Thank you for watching this video. Have a good day, y'all. Deuces.